Hey there folks, welcome back to Let's Play Red Dead Redemption 2. I'm Mysterious JG, and I still don't have a cowboy song prepared, but we do have new enemies, the inbred weirdos in the hills. <laughs> so our gangs in this game basically consist of... Oh, that's not what I actually meant to do. Our gangs in this game actually consist of... Um, like, Confederate loyalists the O'Driscoll boys, who are just kind of another gang like ours. And uh, then we've got um, the inbred weirdos. So who these other... Oh, and the Del Lobo gang, an informative gang to the outlaws, mercenaries, and exiles to make up the Del Lobo gang. What? An informative guide. Oh, never mind. That was an actual description of who they are. Mostly Mexican men who are outlaws, exiles, or opportunists. So loyalty is not something that is even important. The dispute between Mexico and America has brought the gang to the town of these landing. Here they steal, fight, and often kill people. Okay. I think we came, came across them during a mission um, <clears throat> fighting against that gunslinger, but they're probably more of a post-story gang to deal with, which would explain why they're at the end of the list here. All right. Anyway, we're, speaking of uh, gunfighting missions, that's kind of what we're on now is uh, dealing with one last gunfighter. Or maybe there's ten more to go. I don't know. But I did, between videos, look. Yeah, you can find um, that camp camping in their territory. Yeah, like they, that's on YouTube. I didn't dream it up. Matter of fact, uh, the video I found of it is happening in broad daylight, which made it much weirder and kind of less frightening than when I was playing the game because I was camping in the middle of the night, and uh, it happened. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, I should have greeted him. So we're crossing the Lemoyne Mountain. Uh, boundary here and going into some non-Lemoyne zone. I guess we're leaving Lemoyne and going into New Hanover. Yeah, I think we're leaving Lemoyne and going into New Hanover. We didn't actually feed our horse when we camped, just ourselves, so that was rude. There's a red dot. I guess that might have been a snake. I'm not sure. Yeah. Did I save when I camped? I'm not sure if I did. I should have done. But I don't think I actually did. Not a whole lot of... Uh, Human traffic out here. Human trafficking. Sorry, that's not a fun thing to just casually reference. Yeah, we really don't know what those inbreds are doing with people in the caves, but um, hopefully we won't have to go there, try to find out, and fail, because then we'd be forced to remember our failure in the caves. And that could be a big, big thing that okay. shapes other movies to rip it off for many years to come. right near the edge of the world here, because um, I do believe if we try to swim out there, it's game over, yeah, although there must be something going on over here, because there's a zone that's um, marked all in red, so maybe you can swing up far enough north that there's a land connection over here. At any rate, I want to save my game in case uh, something goes horribly wrong here, so let's do that. A bright, bouncing boy. Now, considering how much uh, side content and stuff there is to do in these games, I'm guessing the story will tight, will wrap up sometime when we're in like the 70% completion range. So I got to think that we're more than halfway through the actual story of the game, but I really don't know. I am playing it blindish. I, I, I had one major fact uh, spoiled for me that's kind of shadowing how I imagine the game has got to end, but... I do not know the details, which is good. I'm quite pleased with that. So please, if you know details about the ending, um, but you're watching my LP because you enjoy my play style, I thank you, and please don't spoil anything. Okay. For some reason, this, uh, I thought I saw plants that might be pickable. If I was doing the treasure hunting mini games, which in the moment I'm not, that seems like some place where there might be something going on. Let's 
here's a brand new town, which. Hey, partner. Gentlemen. Morning. Hey there, partner. I'm not as excited as I should be about finding a whole new town. Wakey, wakey. Why am I bothering this guy? It looks like there's bounty hunting missions to be done here. Reward. Disappearance of Princess Isabel Katarina Zinmeister. $100 for her safe return. Alright, missing person. I thought that would be a bounty poster. I thought this was Bounty Hunter. Okay there. Make allies of all these people before I start a uh, stranger mission. Very nice. Friends for life, we said. And now the two of you have betrayed me at once. Do you know what betrayal means, Bertram? Nope. No. It means hurting Miss Marjorie. Queen Marjorie. You liked me. I've clothed you. I fed you. Okay, this would not appear to be the same mission that I thought we were on. Um, that one must be further up. Okay, so we've actually gotten interrupted by the wrong stranger mission. FF out burnout. Bertram does like Miss Marjorie. Yes, and Miss Marjorie likes Bertram. So why don't you go and tell me where that nasty little Magnifico has run off to so I can get on with webbing that snot nose right into shape? He owes me. He owes us. Big time. Bertram and Marjorie. Whoop. Everything okay? Bertram Whoop. like a sherry. Oh, I guess I just and really messed this up. Saving people. Taking them to your breast, and metaphorically, I mean, like a mother, caring and raising them, and then they go and stab you in the back. Have you ever betrayed a close friend? I hope not. Well. Treachery. And these are sad. Though. Well, I mean, I probably will before the game's over, but. I made them stars, dreamers, entertainers, and they. Oh no, now family's not enough. No, no, he's gone off alone. My little no, tiny magician I... has gone and stabbed his mom on the back. Oh, fuck it, he. Fuck it. Bertram, 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 woof, woof. Bertram, put the nice man down. Do something, he'll eat him. Um, uh, e e easy there. Uh, easy there. Uh -oh. Bertram! Easy. Uh. Easy. Uh. Stop. Mean man. Uh. Fuck. Don't know how to do this. Easy boy. Uh. 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 Mister. Good thing slamming the button seems to generally just work okay. Not nice. Well, you're not. Bertram got a whoop. Come here, Bertram. Let me put you on my breast metaphorically. Oh yes, Marjorie's here. No one's gonna hurt you ever again. Mama. You should keep that thing in a cage. Anybody want to thank me for? Who you're barely. Don't worry, we'll pay yeah, you. Yeah, we want to thank the guy for Bertram. subduing oh, the giant freak. You like Mama does. No one cares for you like I do, especially not that Magnifico. Hmm? But he's my friend. Yes, well, if he were your friend, he'd be here, wouldn't he? He wouldn't have abandoned us. Oh, you wouldn't have gotten that whoopsie, would you? Whoopsie heart. I know. Mama's going to make it all better. But first, you got to tell me where that little worm ran off to. Hmm? Is bartender really not interested in getting them out of here? Magnifico made a promise, too, huh? He made more than a promise. He made a contract, and he broke it. So and I'm an expert in contract law, so... And then we will all be even. That's my boy. 
camping in the woods. Why didn't you tell me in the first place? You just apologize to these men. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You gave me a whoopsie. Hey, you just stay away from that sherry now, you hear? Bertram Black Sherry. Oh, don't you get him started. Thank you for all of your help, Mr. Stranger. If you see that slippery little fella sleeping rough out there, would you just make a little racket and then we'll come along and we'll find you? I could try. I'd no, love to betray this stranger to you though. who appears to be evil. Come, when you see him. come along, Bertram. He looks like Tyrion Lannister. So I can't even drink the beer? Oh, well, where's my hat? At least I'll get my hat back after all that. Morning. Howdy, fellas. Morning, mister. Morning. Don't think this day can get much worse. How you doing, friend? Is that a hooker? Hi, uh, folks. Hi, darling. Morning. Good morning. Y'all doing all right? Mm. All the best now. Bye. This game does not appear to have prostitution. I mean, I haven't been going out of my way looking for it. I'm not a big one for spending video game money on video game hookers, but... Howdy. Morning, miss. Um... But, uh, yeah, I haven't found it at all in this game, which is kind of surprising. It's definitely part of the original Red Dead Redemption. Okay, fella. Alright, so we got an additional stranger mission now to go find uh, Magnifico. And uh, there he is, apparently. I don't know why it's not telling me more about that mission, but it's not. Uh, maybe we'll go find Magnifico, but I'd like to get back on track with what we were doing, which was going to wrap up this whole quest of... Uh, hey there. This whole quest related to um, the um, Gunslinger yeah. biography. You know, we took a bit of a whooping there, but um, apparently our cores are okay. So that's a little, a little small-ish town, Van Horn Trading Post. Okay, so that didn't count as a major town. So up here is an actual separate town that um, this guy's sheriff of. Because I was thinking, wow, it's actually a pretty long, continuous chunk of urban area for this game. Times. Please, please. I can't feel the leg anymore. You have to get the strap off me. Please. Oh, it's a trap. It's different. You all right? Oh, looks <laughs> like you could use a hand. Oh, please. please. I just decided to greet him. Hope I got some points for that. Please save me. This is probably them. Oh, good. We did the trap minigame. Oh, oh, you did it! Oh, oh, I, uh, I gotta get some scrap or, or something. Oh, uh, that's not really where you got wounded. I thought I was gonna be. Oh, go! Oh, I thought I was gonna be a goner. Oh, you, you can take whatever you want from my pack for saving me. Oh. Can I give him whiskey? Yeah, this will help with the pain at least. It's uh, oh, yeah. 
it's that cinnamon flavored stuff, so this so is kind of nasty. Pistol cartridges, repeater cartridges. Doesn't seem to be a whole lot else. It's just a random encounter. Game's got a lot of them. Well, I mean, as long as you get back to town, but you'd like help with that, I, I guess that's not in the offing. Okay, bye. talking. There's all sorts of ricochet rabbits. Couldn't quite run them over. Didn't quite have the energy to try for anything else. No, it's pristine. And it would appear that I'm allowed to hunt them. I mean, they look like, they look like something that I would probably belong on a farm, but, um, no, they're a cow elk. Roanoke Ridge. Well, see, what the hell? I just hit the regular old get off your horse button. So it's not in balance. I know. It sounds crazy. But look around you. Look around. And lay. And weep. Do I get to greet you or not? Hey there. Mister. Read this book. It is the future of American science. And crazy hairstyles. It's mm. called Dianetics. Thank you. Hope for the future. Scoff not. Dan H. Excavation of the Science, the Skies, the Water, and the Great Swindle. I speak the truth. We are killing this land. Oh. Killing it with greed. He's an killing environmentalist way, way ahead of his time here. The land will boil. The sea will dry up. The world will heat. The world will heat. Okay, you're getting kind of ahead of what people understood about this at the time. But, uh, um, okay. Man, when did Rockstar get so, like, uh, social justice warrior? Everything is here in the cabin. Just make a selection, and I can bring it out for you to eat. Let's see if there's any cool whoppets that I don't already have here. So, I already own... I should already own most everything. But it could be that there's stuff that wasn't sold before. Litchfield Repeater? Is locked. Looks like they're not selling anything else. Oh, Semi auto shotgun I can buy. Here you go. I'm not going to uh, change it around right now. I think I'm doing okay for um, ammo. So we got a new, we got a new type of shotgun and a new type of stone cold. That's it for now. You can make a new type of stone cold. Sorry, I'd say. Text notification you got in one of the old SmackDown versus Raw games. The Bobo and I always found amusing. There's actually a newspaper seller up here. Maybe I want to visit him real quick. He seems to be trying that hard to get people's attention, does he? Hello. Hey. Well, 
Okay. I guess I got all the newspapers. Because I can't interact with him at all. Alright, well, once again, let's save the game in case I do something horribly wrong here. My lovely oars running through the field. Alright. Save our game. We'll put four cards face down in our graveyard and end our turn. It's me misquoting uh, Yu Gi Oh! I kind of do. Um, so apparently, somebody knows I'm out here. Grits. It's what's for breakfast. Notice social order. Does not appear to be something we can actually interact with. There's a wanted poster that uh, we also can't actually interact with. Well, well, look at this stuff. You, I'm looking for Slim Grant, State Marshal. Trying to kill him for no real reason. Boys know where to find him. Oh, Mr. Marshal was here last week. I think he headed up to Beaver Hollow looking for some outlaws. Is he coming back? Sure. When he catches them fellers. Assume the outlaws don't kill him. How long has he been gone? Well, a couple of days. Well, you ain't gonna go look for him? If your boss's boss, who you all hated, went missing, possibly dead, at the hands of a bunch of violent wanted men, Makes would point. you go looking for him? Well, yeah, probably, because I'm a fool. Well, when he's dead, maybe I'll become marshal. I'll be a hero riding a horse from town to town, mister. Think of that. Good luck with those dreams. <laughs> Piece of shit, dumbass. Seems unlikely that you'll become a hero of any kind, but, um... Where the hell did my horse end up? I guess he... I guess he teleported to, um... Cause this isn't where I left him. He actually teleported closer to, uh... To my last known position here. Yeah. Alright, pal. Let's go figure out what the hell's going on. Why? Is the game going to give me a little yellow path or not? I will force it to make a red path if it does not make me a yellow path soon. <laughs> Outlaw camp. Okay, well. I managed to, like, logic my way to the correct path. I'm enjoying this new little section of map here. Ah, oh, there. I'm glad I darn near killed you. So, apparently this is a mining camp? Or, oh, it's a logging camp. As evidenced by, you know... The logs. Hey, partner. Hey, friend. Hey there, fella. Partner. Hello. How's it going? This sign might give me a clue. Mine entrance. No, I'm it as a mining camp. We may yet have a story mission set in a mine. Turning this game into Wild Western Neo. I actually go. I saw some kind of cool animal that I just kind of snuck up on there. But I'm wondering if I ride all the way to where this guy is, kill the outlaws to, to get him, and then then duel him. American something or other squirrel. 
It's Rocky, the flying squirrel. He's getting pretty excited too. All right, so what we're gonna do here is um, I'm gonna save my game. Can't save my game. I was thinking of calling in a video and then having the next video start with this exciting uh, action, uh, which might still be a good idea even if I can't save. Yes, this video will be a little on the short side, but we're going to call it a video, and when we come back next time, action. Well, I'm Sirius GG. Thanks for watching. I hope you join me next time for action.